shows kind of how much your life can change in a year and how much my life has changed over the past six or seven, uh, you know, from not knowing what this game is to, uh, you know, being at the top almost. George Karloftis moved from Athens, Greece to West Lafayette in junior high. And until he became a Red Devil, Karloftis never touched a football. He quickly excelled at the sport, leading West Lafayette to a class 3A state championship his senior year. Karloftis continued his football career just down the road at Purdue University. The hometown hero played three seasons for the Boilermakers and then declared for the NFL draft, where he was selected 30th overall by the Kansas City Chiefs. Joining the Chiefs, you know, it's, a, it's probably one of the most storied organizations in the NFL, a lot of history, a lot of tradition, uh, which is exactly, you know, what you want to play for as a player. Karloftis was drafted last April and so far in his rookie season has 33 tackles and six sacks, including one in the AFC championship game. You got to get to Joe Burrow if you want to beat the Bengals. So uh, definitely a crazy game, just like almost every playoff game is and, uh, you know, wouldn't, wouldn't trade the result for anything. Karloftis credits Purdue for preparing him for this new chapter of his life. My time at Purdue was uh, invaluable. You know, those, those three years I spent there, I mean, just uh, how much I grew as a person, as a, as a player, as, also just generally about life, you know, because now I'm on my own. It's just definitely a change from being five minutes from my mom's house. Karloftis still watches Purdue and West Lafayette football and has a younger brother on each team. After the AFC championship, Karloftis said he had over 500 text messages from former coaches and teammates. He said it's also nice hearing from other Purdue defensive players in the NFL. All of them have said uh, congratulatory uh, texts. It's awesome to be kind of a part of that, uh, that fraternity, I guess, that not too many people have. Uh, it's, it's a blessing. Karloftis said it would be huge to get the job done and win the Super Bowl, to build a legacy for himself and this team. Whenever you go somewhere, you're, you're announced as a Super Bowl champion and then your name, you know, so that, that, that holds a lot of weight. That's something, you know, that, that transcends time. From Gordon Straley Field to Super Bowl 57. Reporting from West Lafayette, Kelly Hallinan, Sports 18.